Hi, Mark Johnson here, age 63. I told you uh, that in our last video, I want to do a video for my subscribers once every other week. So here we are, two weeks later. And I'd like to talk to you in this video about how I eat. Now, I am not a believer in one size fits all, so I'm not assuming that the way I eat is the way everybody else should eat. But I want to share with you what I found works for me and see if something helps you. Just to put it in a little bit of a context, a few years ago, I weighed uh, 30 pounds plus from what I weigh now. I was able to take the weight off and I've kept it off for a number of years. So what I'm doing works for me. How I lost the weight originally was I went on a low carbohydrate diet, started at about 20 grams of carbs a day. And then after I lost a fair amount of weight, I would add five a day per week uh, until I kind of found uh, where I needed to stabilize. Right now, I probably only eat about 50 carbs a day. That's not uh, very many, but it's just a lifestyle uh, that I've gotten used to. Now, one of the things you can do if you have heavy weightlifting days, you could have a few more carbs the days you're lifting weights and then the days you're not lifting weights uh, back off and have fewer carbs. What I like to do is have about a five pound range and when I get to the upper part, then I get stricter with my eating. And uh, if I'm in the middle, then I kind of eat the way I normally eat. And then if I get down lower, uh, then I might be a little more liberal uh, in my eating. Uh, for me, in the summer, I might uh, be about five pounds or so heavier than in the winter. I live in Minnesota, winters are cold, so I don't mind uh, a few extra pounds in the winter and then trim down a little bit more uh, in the summer. Uh, by the way, I do not do a long, slow distance cardio as a part of my plan. There was a day years ago I did that. I'll talk to you about that in maybe another session. One thing that does work for me uh, is uh, intermittent fasting, especially if I'm uh, needing to drop a couple of pounds or whatever. Uh, for me, I eat in a typically during a 12 hour window uh, or a 16 hour window and then fast the rest of the time. So I like uh, fasting or eating from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. and then from 7 p.m. not to eat anything till 11 a.m. the next day works well for me. You can adjust that and I do that most days. Um, Sometimes not. Uh, then also probably one day a week, I'll fast 24 hours and often two or three days, five days, uh, every eight, maybe once a quarter or so. That's more for spiritual reasons than losing weight. One thing that uh, we've just learned to do, my wife and I, is we eat this way no matter what. If we're on vacation, we eat this way. If we're at a restaurant, we eat this way. If we're at somebody else's home, uh, yeah, if I'm ordering at a restaurant instead of the fries, uh, it'll be, you know, broccoli or cauliflower or something like that. And I'll, uh, if I have to give away the fries or not even eat them, I'm okay with that. Uh, and typically the hamburger, no bun, just cheese and so forth. Um, so what do I eat? I eat eggs, I eat meat, lots of meat, uh, eat vegetables, and I tend not to eat a lot of fruit. Fruit is high in carbs, so uh, if I'm on my lower end, I may eat a little more fruit, uh, but overall I don't eat a lot of fruit because of the high sugar content and carbs. Uh, something else I'll mention, a lot of people ask me if I take TRT, uh, testosterone replacement therapy and the answer is no I have never done that uh, I have never taken any uh, performance enhancing drugs at all uh, so I completely train natural the only thing I do is uh, add uh, protein powder uh, to uh, some of the meals I have I'll, I'll have protein powder to get some extra protein but there again I'll make sure it's low carb protein uh, just a hint if you're really wanting to watch your weight or lose some body fat is don't drink calories, don't drink carbohydrates. They do not fill or satisfy as much. 
So um, the only time I will pretty much drink carbs or calories is if it's a replacement drink and that's my meal. Often I'll do a bulletproof coffee with a scoop of protein powder in it. Uh, and then that'll be my uh, only uh, what the only thing I eat for that meal. So anyway, I hope something there uh, helps you. And uh, I think what we'll talk about in two weeks is how I train. And uh, we'll also be looking eventually at what about recovery and those kinds of things. And maybe next week I'll be ready to share with you the next challenge I'm taking on. So till next time, here's to your health, both physically and especially spiritually. See you next time.